I can go to the right earth spot and be right tomorrow. I'm gonna have to be the election again. Um, with my phone here, I'm gonna update you guys on the election. I just know the music killer guy how it was four years ago. <laughs> So you guys, it's the night before election 2020 and across the street they got it all boarded up across from the Beverly Center here in California. I'm just leaving work. I had to do inventory. <sighs> like I don't mind it because I don't have to go to work until like 4 tomorrow so. Um, but the same thing looks like outside. Sorry for my dirty window. Jeff wanted to show you. Oops. Jeff wanted to. Ooh. <laughs> then I'm show you my face. All over. All of my face. But yeah, going back to my apartment right now. And I'm gonna probably edit a video because I don't know. I'm not that tired. I honestly will probably crash when I get home. So. <sighs> There's a lot of places bordered up right now. Okay, not like not where I'm at right now, but like I guess they're supposed to be. I guess they are supposed to be right tomorrow, no matter who wins, Donald Trump or Joe Biden. And uh, like I'm kind of scared. Um, yeah, just scared for tomorrow, I guess, because I close tomorrow. And um, yeah. Uh, the Trump supporters said no. I guess not. All, I, I don't even know. But yes, I saw it on the internet. I don't know if it's true or not, but you never know. Said they were gonna shoot and kill people who are POC, people of color, and who are part of the LGBT plus community. And like, I find that crazy. And a little bit scary, so. But I'm gonna go because I'm driving, and I'll see you guys later. <laughs> Well, the camera looks clearer than ever. But what is up? Everybody is noon. November 3rd, 2020. Today is election day and I'm just gonna film my reaction. <laughs> Not, I guess my reaction, but I'm gonna be at work when everything goes down. So, hoping for the best. I woke up till like 10 30 because I got back home at like 3. Or, no, I didn't go to bed until like 3. I told you, yeah, around there because I got got home at like 2.30, 2.45, I went to bed at 3. And then I missed my, um, my little uh, Zoom interview with, uh, somebody from the school. So we're gonna do something tomorrow and, oh, today I'm just gonna check it. You can see I'm gonna try and edit, edit a video, find the motivation to do that. I'm not gonna dress all fancy today, um, but yeah, I'm gonna shave, as you can't tell. And yeah. Alright, All right, y'all. Remind me to never park under a tree again. Man, it's kinda hot in here. <laughs> my car got some birds shit around my car. <laughs> you really say I shit it up. If you don't know that, make your song done. In a bar. But right now I'm about to go get something to eat and then head. Mmm, that hurt. Uh, I forgot what time I work. I guess I'll update you guys later. <sighs> Alright, guys, I just got home from work and I'm about to change about to this. I'm probably just put some sweats on. Um, with my phone there, I'm gonna update you guys on the election. Right now, Joe Biden has 223 electoral votes and Donald Trump has 174. But I'm about to change it and I'll keep you guys updated. Tonight, George and Texas is representative of the They just, <laughs> my hair. Okay, I'm gonna say that real quick before they talk about any, anything else. Cause this is all live and I don't think there's gonna be any commercials. So, um, anyways. They just said that it looks like Trump is gonna win Texas. But I know I gotta keep because there will be. Look at it. That, no, it's not real, is it? Okay, on, on here on Google it says Joe Biden has 223 electoral votes and Donald Trump has 212. Ooh, I'm, oh, I'm so nervous. I'm done with my dinner because I cannot eat anymore. Let me update my phone. But yesterday I found out that there might be like, well I really do honestly feel like there's 100% going to be riots no matter who wins. But someone said that 
if Trump loses, their, some of the Trump supporters are gonna go out and kill people of color, the LGBT plus community, and people of color. And that low key scared me yesterday to start and keep looking because I want to make sure, like, I can hear everything. But, um, yeah, they're just scary because I'm a person of color and I'm a part of the LGBT plus community. So, yeah, they're, they're definitely scared, <laughs> scared me for a second. Like, and then the fact that my work told me tonight, like, to stay safe. Okay, not Jeff D, but like our whole team, they told us to stay safe, and it's just kind of like scary. Like, we shouldn't have to be doing that, you know what I mean? I don't know, I'm just, <coughs> I just don't want to be scared again how I was four years ago. Like, I don't know if I told you guys that, but four years ago, I was at a local club in Michigan. And they had the election on. When I found that Donald Trump won, I was like, what the fuck? Like, I was scared. And, like, the next morning I woke up, I was just like, damn. Like, my rights can be get taken away. People can just beat me up because of who I love or, like, the color of my skin. And, I mean, that can happen any day, really. Like, Donald Trump really made it normalized. With, racist, with people who are racist and just everything and it just... Uh, 209 electoral votes, Donald Trump, 23 seats, 212 electoral votes. No. Senate race there as well. We have not yet where things stand now. 85% of the expected vote in. Donald Trump's still ahead. A lot of vote out time. So the big question is... Oh, I'll get you guys. Alright. So you guys. Oh, hold on. This is... I didn't know if, if it was gonna pause or not, but this is what the votes are looking like. We obviously don't have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10 states who are voted. In one of my common that I, that I ate. Um, no, I'm just trying to figure it out. So, like, I don't have shadows on my eyes and, like, on my face and you can see my face. Right now it's 11.44, Tuesday, November 3rd, 2020, here in Los Angeles, California. Today is going, I don't even know how today is going, honestly. I am not ready for all of this. As you can see, I'm tired. They said that there were so many absentee votes due to COVID and other people who like could not vote in the polls today. There are so many like ballots that we won't get the final results until like tomorrow or a couple of days, which is scary. If you think about that, like it is really scary because they're only counting the they're really only counting the votes that people voted today at the polls. They're not counting everybody vote. They're not even counting my vote right now because I did absentee ballot. It's scary. America, you really got me fucked up. But yeah, I'm just waiting on and this to see what happens. And I'm just gonna give you guys an update and give you my first reaction on who runs the, the election of the president of the United States here in 2020. A side note, the next presidential election, my little brother will be, my like baby baby brother will be able to vote in 2024, which I find crazy. It just came back on, I know, update you guys. Uh, yeah, in this next clip, I am, um, how long time you? Like, I just woke up. <laughs> so, um, don't mind me. Good morning guys, I just woke up and the last night I didn't get to see who, who won so this morning I'm going to uh, look at my phone and see who won and give you guys my first live reaction of who the president is. <laughs> you boys so nervous. Nobody won. Nobody won yet. Alright, I guess I'll update you guys when I get a, get a, um, an update. I'll collect my camera and we'll be dying too. Accurate count. It's the law. The law says count every eligible vote, and that's exactly what's happening all across Pennsylvania right now. So we're not going to let anything
I actually either start editing a video because it doesn't gonna take too long if I just sit here and watch the election. So I'll give you guys in like an hour or two. I totally forgot my camera was up here, but it, you can't tell I got ready and my hair is like really tall and like doing its own thing. But I just registered for the spring classes. I'm kind of, I'm really mad at myself for not going to school this semester, but I guess it's whatever. But I'm taking four classes, pretty basic classes. Taking this semester off set me back because I would have graduated. Uh, next fall, but that's upcoming for, for yeah, next fall. But no, I'm probably gonna graduate in 2022, which I don't want that to happen. But I guess since that's happening, whatever. But yeah, I'm gonna watch a little bit more of the debates and not debate the election, and uh, I'll keep you guys updated. This is what it's looking like right now. My hair is so tall. legal vote counts and matters and they're going to make sure that that happens here in the peach state oh as you guys can't tell i'm getting ready for work that's about it put my mask on the wrong way okay but yeah let's get going <laughs> if i <sighs> Hold on. got my little earring in my dangle dangly one and then just just my little like cross i don't know if it's upside down or if it's up oh if right okay and just got my two little studs up or my ring and then my stud up here honestly like three years ago two years ago i would never thought i would have had earrings right here because i just got them almost a year ago now i got them on my birthday and when i put my mask in my bag i i just wore this i got them for yesterday from work let's go so you know, what is up? Are you funny? <laughs> there's no update on the election. But yeah, there's no update on the election. Oh, or actually, there is. Michigan went blue. blue Democrat, but barely <laughs> went Democrat. Um, let me tell you. It was Democrat 50.5%, Republican 48%. And right now, it is Joe Biden, 264 electoral votes. And Donald Trump, 214 electoral votes. <sighs> yeah, alright. But yeah, I'm gonna start editing the video so I can get it out. Why do I keep going on focus? Oh, because it's focusing on that. <sighs> yeah, I'm gonna start editing the video, get it up. I haven't posted the video in so long. Until next time, if there's any more update, hopefully tomorrow, I'll let you guys know. Until then, I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye. <laughs>